name is Christina Maniscalco. Um, I've been selling Pampered Chef for six years. I love, 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 love my job. Um, I love it. Um, I actually <laughs> love it so much that I quit my day job um, in 2013 to do Pampered Chef for um, I came to the point where I was making more money at Pampered Chef than it was my full time job at a law firm. Wow. And um, this is way more fun. So now I work just three days a week. And I earn, I earn just as much money as I did at the law firm. So it's way fun. Um, we do, anybody can be a consultant. You can be a stay at home mom, or you could be a doctor. We have doctors in our business, and they just want to have a fun night out and make a little bit of extra money. Or, um, you know, you could be a school teacher and, and do this during the, the summertime. So it's really up to you, whatever you want to do. Um, but enough about me. You guys can ask me questions later. Um, I have lots of tickets tonight, so that's going to be the name of the game tonight. Um, so I just want to go around really quick um, and see what your favorite products are. So if anybody here has a favorite product they can't live without, I want to know about it. So while you're thinking and getting your wheels turning, I do want to thank Diana for having all of us. Everybody oh, should have a drink, right? Yeah, this is so let's party. all um, toast our hosts and thanks Diana for ha thank Diana for having us. Look, I'm gonna get my water. Um, so thank you so much for having us tonight. Thank you for coming. Um, you're gonna get lots of free stuff, discounted stuff. So um, yay, everybody toast our hosts. Yay. yay. So this is for you. Um, this is our latest and greatest season's best cookbook. These are great. They're in a catalog. They make great greeting cards because they're only two dollars, and you can mail them across country. And they're great recipes. Um, and then I also gave you a little heart. Um, a little candy dish. Yeah, yeah, it was on the outfit that you tried to get on yesterday. Yeah, so, I needed that. Thanks. How'd you know? You're welcome. <laughs> Not a blue cutting board, sorry. <laughs> okay, so um, did anybody think of a favorite Pampership product that you can't live without? I have a couple of them. Okay, well, okay, if you were going to go to a, if you were going to go to an island and you could only bring one product, what would it be? Oh, that'll work on that. Oh, yay! Oh, that'll work on that. That's great. Okay, what's your favorite thing that you use in a food chopper for? Chopping vegetables. Or food on the island. I love it. Or nuts, or chicken, or anything. Yeah, I do nuts with it. Yeah, I've done chicken too. Deb, what's your favorite product? That spiral thing. The spiral and slice? Yeah. The one you could do zucchini? Yeah. Yay! I it all the time. Yay, can you find it? Is there, are you on the page? Oh, you can show it. Page 25. So this spiral and slice is really cool. It was turned to Kini into like pasta. Yeah. And cucumbers are the bomb. Yeah. And radishes and stuff. Super. Yeah. Awesome. What's your favorite? Mix and chop. The mix and chop. Oh, yeah. Oh, love that. And we're on page 13 for the mix and chop. It's great for uh, ground beef. Yeah, so that's the name of the game. Ground beef or ground turkey. Anybody else have a favorite? Uh, the bar pan. The bar pan. The bar pan. Yeah. Yeah. for everything. I mean, meat, you know, toast. What is that? It's a little mini bar pan. It's a stone. Yeah. Oh. And it fits in a toaster oven. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I got. That's what I got. It's in here, Sorry. <laughs> She's just going to show you the whole time. the first thing. <laughs> there you go. On the bottom of page six. So we're at Stonework. So what's the best thing about Stonework? Yeah. You know? What's the best, what's the best thing about it? I have to wash it. Well, there's that. You do have to wash it. It's okay. Yeah, it's just some hot water and the scraper comes with but You can use it. Yes, you can use it. Dishwasher, no little, you know, pillows of soap on sanitized. No and you know what? Done. Yes. You never have to worry about it. You never have to scrape it so under hot water. Yeah. Isn't that cool? Yeah. That's good. Yay. I learned that tonight because I told her, I said, I don't like the stone I don't like the rock rocks. Yeah. So the stone was really cool. Like, I can't ever burn anything on it. Right. Yeah, nothing <laughs> ever works. So, I might need some yeah. stoneware. You know, I'm a terrible cook. Stoneware. I can make some of these. I can bake them in there for like an hour. They'll be rock hard, but they won't ever burn. Yeah. So if you're going to burn the bottoms of cookies or cupcakes or muffins, the best stoneware in all the rooms. Better season than it. Okay, anybody else have a favorite? Yeah. 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 Yeah.
um, it, it cuts around the can, so it's a. Sh um, you didn't figure it out. It's not a sharp edge. <laughs> works as a lid. It works really well. Yeah. I, I Them really too. Hey, can you show us? Okay. Can we close? I'm gonna pull around several times with my. It has a five-year warranty, so after after five years, I did notice that mine. I had to start going around a couple times. So you may just need a new one. But if you mm -hmm. go around a couple times, it still works. But yeah, it does. Yeah, it has a five-year warranty, though. Half of it. Well, good. Do you guys have a favorite over here? The can opener? Yay. Anybody else? We're all good? A mix and chop. Awesome. All right. OK, so I'm going to talk about a couple products. And then has anybody been to a camera shop party in like the last nine months or so? Week. Oh, and we, <laughs> do you know if they did a station style party? Yes. Okay, good. So you guys cooked and you have to do that? No, no, we sat. Okay, you can still do that tonight. But tonight we're going to do a station style. Yes, and Sarah, you're participating. Anybody over here do a, a spiritual like It's my house. Spiritual. I like that. I used to so, it. It's going to be fun. Oh, awesome. How long has it been? We figured we got to cook every night of the week. Why yeah. should we cook? Oh, wow. Wow. Okay. Uh, yeah, I know. But and it was a small wow. kitchen. Yeah. Okay, so, so here we go. <laughs> I'm going to tell really you guys good. about my two favorite products, and then we're going to get cooking. So tonight we're going to do like a station style party. Um, I've, t I've set up two stations, and then we're going to do the lava cake together because I think it's really important for you guys to all see the lava cake in action. Yeah. Otherwise, you won't believe me that we did it in the Okay. So we do the lava cake together. Um, we're going to do. 15 minute chicken fajitas, because that's what Diana picked out. <coughs> and she also picked out the chipotle chili, uh, not chipotle chili, but the chipotle chicken nacho dip, which is amazing, Ooh. on our new round stone with handles. So you guys may have a flyer in your packet. It has handles, yes, it's amazing. So this is one of my favorites, so I guess I can talk about it too. Um, but this is the new, it's kind of like a pizza stone. Um, it's also called the large round stone with handles, and it's glazed. So it's really pretty. Um, yeah. Obviously, the more you use your stone, the darker it will get. The more seasoned it is, the more nothing will stick to it. Um, but I use mine. This one for pizza. I use it for cookies. Um, this Chipotle chicken nacho dip. We're going to do our chicken over here in the oven. And then we're going to take it out, chop up the chicken, add some other ingredients, and then bake it again. And it'll be really nice and pretty. I also use this just as like a cheese um, board. Just like as a serving dish. It's really big. So you can use it for lots of things. So stoneware, that's part of our stoneware collection. Oh, your cheese ball will go good on there with crackers. Yeah, absolutely. Or bake free. You and your cheese ball. On the other two things I'm going to talk area. about um, are the Ross Crawl. And the deep cover baker. Does anybody have a deep cover baker? No. Amy Freeze? Oh, yeah. Raise your hand. Yay. Awesome. So did you guys know that the deep cover baker, you can turn any crock pot recipe into the microwave 30 minutes? You can do it in a deep cover baker. Awesome. So if you um, like to cook in the microwave or don't have a, a vessel for the microwave, the deep cover baker or the rock crock are your, your vessels that you want to purchase. Because these things um, will get dinner done in less than 30 minutes. They come out moist and delicious and yummy. So the difference between the deep cover baker and the rock crock, the rock crock is um, ceramic stoneware. So it goes on the stove top, in the oven, in the microwave, on the grill, and in the dishwasher. Okay, that's the rock crock. That's this one right here. And it comes in three different sizes. This is the largest one that we're going to do the cake in. This is the smallest one. And then there's a the medium one in between. So this one's a great casserole size. You could mm -hmm. use this for like a family of two or three um, and do chicken in there. Um, in the microwave in like 12 minutes, you could do a pork tenderloin in there or a side dish. It works really well. You can also steam vegetables or reheat leftovers. We're going to actually just steam our tortilla shells in here tonight. I have those in there already. Um, the deep cover baker, you could do any recipe from the deep cover baker in the rock pot. Um, but remember, the deep cover baker only goes in the microwave and in the oven, okay? So you can still do your whole chicken in 30 to 45 minutes. Comes out like a rotisserie chicken. It's delicious. Um, pork tenderloin in 10 minutes. Um, chicken breast in like 8 to 10 minutes. Am I blowing your mind that? Yeah. Yes. It's amazing. Like if you need dinner on the table in less than 30 minutes, you do your on less than 30 minutes. But you guys are all going to use these products tonight. Um, the other favorite, I know I said I was only going to talk about two, but there's one more. Does anybody have this? Yeah. This is my favorite. This is the manual food product. 
processor. So it comes in, it's just three pieces. So this is the blade. We used that last time, remember? Yeah. Yeah, we're trying to use it. Yeah. <laughs> You're gonna use it tonight, it works really well. So it's kind of like our food chopper, but it's um, an actual bowl. So you can mix and combine and chop all at the same time in here. So I make egg salad in here, you can make chicken salad. You do salsa, guacamole, pasta. Um, lizards, all sorts of stuff in here. But you guys are going to use it tonight to uh, chop up some green onions and red bell pepper. It, the bottom two are dishwasher safe and then the lid is hand wash only. And I have that little sticker on there just for my husband. <laughs> the other thing, I bring all of my dirty dishes home with me because my husband does them. Um, we get to earn a trip every year. Yeah, so he gets to go on vacation for free, so he has to kind of earn it. So, <laughs> so he, um, I just put all of my dishes in a, in a garbage bag, and I take them home, and he loads the dishwasher. It's not very hard, and our, my, my host and I do not have to do them, so we kind of both win, right? Yes. yes. <laughs> okay, so... my husband would leave them till tomorrow, or next week, to live them. Right, Eric? <laughs> okay, so later on we're going to play a couple of games, but right now I just want to know who, who, who here brought a guest? Who, who brought a guest tonight? Sarah brought a guest. I think Sarah's the only one. What? Sarah's yes. the only one? Sarah is the only one that brought a guest. Well, I always give the people um, that bring a guest. Yeah. Yeah. No, party crashers. Party crashers, yeah. Wait, where's Sarah? Sarah, yay, Sarah. I always give really nice gifts to those that bring party crashers. So this one's for you, okay? Yes. And I have lots of gifts tonight, so um, we'll be doing lots of gifts. What is it? Sarah, what is it? Okay, really quick, you guys, I'm just going to go over something that um, our hosts get. So when you host your own party, if you're interested, I want you to think about it throughout the night. If you start seeing lots of tools that you want in your own kitchen, you'll want to host your own party because you're going to get discounts, free stuff, half price items and all of that good stuff. So over here on my brownie pan, I have all of my dates that I'm available in the next like two months. There's only two dates left in February, so if you're interested um, in one of the February dates, I do have a bag that you can go home with and it has a little prize in there for you. Um, and then I have lots of post pockets. So if anybody's interested, I can send you home with one of those. Um, the other thing, um, I'll go over specials and stuff after we're done cooking, okay? Oh, no, no, no. So when we're done cooking, she can't use them all. What's that thing? We have my scissors. All right, so, um, so for now, I just want you guys to kind of split up into two groups. One group is going to do the 